நீயில்லாத நாளல்ல நாளாகுமா நீயில்லாத வாழ்வல்ல வாழ்வாகுமா book of acts chapter 9 verses 26 to 27 when he came to jerusalem he tried to join the disciples but they were all afraid of him not believing that he really was a disciple but barnabas took him and brought him to the apostles he told them how saul on his journey had seen the lord and that the lord had spoken to him and how in damascus he had preached fearlessly in the name of jesus saul received salvation from jesus christ when he was on the way to damascus then he returned to jerusalem his first visit after being saved but the believers were terrified at the news of his arrival because saul tortured christian believers present them and in fact his journey to damascus was to capture christians there he permitted many executions of christians so when the people at jerusalem heard that saul was coming they were terrified and hesitated to accept him at that time Barnabas took Saul and brought him to the apostles. Barnabas was the one who explained Saul's encounter with Jesus in Damascus and encouraged the believers to accept him into the fellowship. Today the Lord puts forth a question before you. What kind of a person are you? Are you being the one who brings people together who went far away from the family or are you being the one who creates gap between people and families? Are you consoling to others? or saying negative and fearful things to make them more discouraged examine find out who you really are the bible says blessed are the peacemakers amen in the family husband and wife must make peace children and parents must make peace many in the family may be apart and separate and may have lost their peace because of that the children of god you must be the ones bringing peace in the family God calls you to be like Barnabas accept and follow his ways and teaching and he will lift you up look at Barnabas even today we talk about him right he was important in the sight of God and was recorded in the scripture because he was accepting accommodating consoling and compassionate you and I must pray for this divine virtue pray and yearn for it the lord will bless you and exalt you hallelujah hallelujah god bless you